today, though we've been talking about the art that I've made in my life, I would like to make a quick pit stop at 11th grade prom. Josie, you say? You were homeschooled. Au contraire, I went to high school for one year because when I was about 15 or 16, I thought, you know what I wanna do? I wanna go to 11th grade and make friends. If you have any questions about the success of my high school career, that kind of sums it up. I was, in fact, an award-winning misfit. Super awkward, probably annoying, definitely quirky. For sure I had bizarre style. Think grunge with crimped hair. And I was pathetically eager to make friends and impress people. Deadly combination. Anywho, of course I did not have a date to prom, so I did what Girls Without Dates will do for 11th grade prom. I went with a pack of other girls. Just to comment about the types of popular girls that I knew. There's two main categories. One is mean popular girls. They're like mean to everyone, including their own friends and hor they're really horrible to everybody else. And then there were nice popular girls. And these are girls that were kind and generous and really attempted to be understanding even with a extremely quirky misfit like myself. Amber Rood, Joni Erickson, Desi Wagi, and Betsy Hedstrom, I salute you. So I got invited to hang out with a pack of girls and get ready at somebody's house. And this girl had a astonishing collection of blue eyeshadow and a closet dedicated to 80s teenage formal wear. So there was eye makeup, which I didn't normally wear. There was hair teasing in the extreme. There was a borrowed dress. That was pink with a bow. And there was an emergency run to the Ben Franklin to pick up nude pantyhose. Drops Mike. Then there was the prom. I frankly don't remember very much. The only thing I remember is that they were assembling the 11th grade girls for a group photo and I actively attempted to avoid it, remember, misfit, awkward, quirky, by hiding behind the balloons and then Mrs. Mershon found me and she hauled my butt out and then because they were already assembled there was nowhere for me to go so they parked me right out in front. I give you prom. Next up, college. 